Astronomy Events February 2023 February starts with one of the most awaited comet C-2022 E3, CTF. It's a long-period comet believed to come from the Oort cloud, the most distant region of Earth's solar system that's, like a big, thick-walled bubble made of icy pieces of space debris that can get even bigger than mountains. The inner edge of this region is thought to be between 2,000 and 5,000 astronomical units AUs, from the Sun, between 186 billion and 465 billion miles. This means that C-2022 E3, ZTF, has made a rare, once-in-a-lifetime journey to be close to Earth. One recent comet of this type, C-2013 A1 sighting spring, previously visited the inner solar system and went near Mars in 2014, but according to the space agency, it won't return for about 740,000 years. February 1st, Comet C-2022 E3, ZTF, at Perigee. The Green Comet recently made its closest approach to the Sun, after having traveled tens of thousands of years from the far fringes of the solar system. It's forecast to be brightest around February 1st, at just slightly brighter than sixth magnitude when the comet is at its closest point to Earth. But don't worry, as you are gazing at this cosmic fuzzball, there's no threat of it crashing into Earth, as it will be 26 million miles away from us at its closest approach. On the day of perigee it will be visible all night because it is circumpolar. It will be highest in the sky at 2212, 45 degrees above your northern horizon. At dusk, it will become visible around 1857, IST, 38 degrees above your northern horizon. It will be lost to dawn twilight around 609, 19 degrees above your northern horizon. February 5th, Full Moon the moon will reach full phase. At this time of the month, it is visible for much of the night, rising at around dusk and setting at around dawn. The snow moon. The sequence of full moons that fall through the year are sometimes assigned names such as the snow moon, according to the months and seasons in which they fall. February 8th, Alpha Centaurid Meteor Shower. Observe the Alpha Centaurid Meteor Shower. It will reach its peak around February 8th, Alpha Centaurids is a minor meteor shower. Such meteor streams produce from 2 to 10 meteors per hour at maximum activity. This year, the Alpha Centaurids will occur shortly after the full moon, which will outshine most of the meteors. So, keep looking for meteors until at least February 15th while the Alpha Centaurids activity is still high. The Alpha Centaurids start on January 28, reach their peak activity around February 8, and end on February 21. Watch the meteor shower near 5 o'clock local time, when its radiant, positioned in the constellation Centaurus, is high above the horizon. The Alpha Centaurids appear to originate from the constellation Centaurus. It's the ninth largest constellation in the sky that is famous for containing Alpha Centauri, the closest star to the solar system. February 21st Venus and Jupiter, a dazzling duo. An hour or so after sunset, look low in the southwest sky to see Venus and Jupiter. Their brightness makes them easily visible, dazzling in the early evening twilight. Venus is the lower and the brighter of the two planets. The planetary pair start the month about 30 degrees apart. As the month goes on, they appear to move closer together each night. By the end of the month, the two appear only about one degree apart in the southwest sky. In reality, the two planets are over 400 million miles apart in space. The evening of February 21st, Venus appears only about five degrees above a barely visible, waxing crescent moon. The evening of February 22nd, that crescent moon appears just to the left of Jupiter. February 23rd, close approach of the moon and Jupiter. The moon and Jupiter will make a close approach, 
passing within one degree three minutes of each other. From some parts of the world, the moon will pass in front of Jupiter, creating a lunar occultation. The moon will be two days old. The moon will be at mag minus 10.3 in Cetus, and Jupiter will be at mag minus 2.1 in Pisces. They will be too widely separated to fit within the field of view of a telescope, but will be visible to the naked eye or through a pair of binoculars. At around the same time, the pair will also share the same right ascension, called a conjunction. Hope you will enjoy the February 2023 astronomy events. If you enjoyed watching the video, do give us a like, also share the same with astronomy lovers. And subscribe to our channel, Secrets of Space, for astronomy updates. Thank you for watching.